Hello, welcome to the channel. I'm going to show you how to replace the fuel filter on this Jaguar 2013 2.2 diesel XF. First of all you lift the engine cover off, that pops off, put that aside. Now these are the connections. You've got to take the, you've got four connections, one, two, three, four. So you pull these two clips together, this connection pulls off. You press that connection, that clip down, that pulls off. And you press this one down, which is a green one, and that pops off, which will be easier to get out when we get this off. Then you've got three bolts. They're all Allen key bolts. There's one here, I've already broken these so they come off. One there. One there. You can see it there. And one here. Three bolts in. Now the filter is ready to come out and we can press the side of this connection. Which is here and that will pop off. Now we've just got to get these connections out like so. And then we have the drain off underneath and the electrical connection. Which is here. Right, the way I prime these fuel filters is simply take this drain bleed, uh, stroke bleed nipple out, a couple of clips there pulls it off, put your finger over the bottom which is where the drain hole is, put your finger over that so it stops any fuel coming out, undo this anti-clockwise, clip it out, you've got a seal on it at the bottom and at the top, then you can prime your fuel filter from here, just pour the in, take off one of these plugs which is, I've taken that one off to allow the air to come in or out um, and then just pour your fuel your diesel fuel in there clean diesel fuel in there until that's topped up fully and you've got your finger over the bottom so it can't come out and once that's topped up fully put that back in screw it back in clockwise until that's done up tight take your finger off the bottom and you can put your drain tube back on and fit your oil filter on and that's primed and that will save you from turning your, turning your engine over a hundred or so times to get the fuel up to get the engine started okay it might start initially but then it will stop until this fuel filter fills up and as the low pressure fuel pump is on the back of the high pressure fuel pump and it sucks the fuel up it takes a lot of turns of the engine to fill this up so you're better off priming it from there and you can put your cover back on and put your filter back on the engine you put this plug back in at the bottom although it's not connected to any wires but you put that plug in where's the uh, drain plug gone Yep. Put the drain plug back in there. Put that back in there. Put these two back on here. Let's 
so press those home and this one and you can put your three bolts back in there's one there Only tool you need basically. This comes out there and put that one back in. And this one, put that cap off there, and that fits back on. And that is the job completed. We'll just start it up, make sure it runs okay, and everything, nothing's leaking. 